Hello there, this is Mr. Fingles, Talking Hands from Bad English Rex. This video that you're watching at is contest entry for Clifford the Vinyl Cheapskate. And I have to say that I appreciate very much that you have uh in your channel name because uh is quite nice a uh, letter and you don't see it often in well in Finland you see but overseas you don't see it often but yeah uh, let's go through uh, the questions and this is just like made for me because I love cheap records and I love to go in to flea markets so number one show me a dollar record and I have to say that uh, I think this was a dollar record because I, I don't remember anymore which one of them uh, I bought uh, for well euro one euro uh, it wasn't dollar of course we're living in Finland we I am living and it was quite nice condition also so I bought it and after that I've been buying more YouTube albums also. Two, uh, show me uh, cheap heat. I was like, what means that? Uh, oh, nice that you explained it. Always cheap and always nice to get. And it is, of course, ABBA. I would guess that in every side of world, well not every side, but in many many places APPA you can find for quite cheap and same goes with this I have bought this for quite cheap hmm. what's this over well you can see ring wear and there's something but it plays it plays quite nice and there's written someone's name and yeah but it was cheap, so why not? Then we go to question number three. Great all around score. And I wish to say this one. Uh, I don't remember, was it like. Or maybe. I, I made a video of, about this, I guess. So maybe it was 25 cents uh, or 50 cents per uh, vinyl, but. Mm, Actually, I have to listen to this maybe tomorrow. Um, now it's too late. Bruce Springsteen, The Wild, Innocent, and the E Street Shuffle. And there was a Hector, Finnish artist. And there is, if I can recommend something, uh, then I would recommend maybe first one. Caronate and Last and Marcy. I don't remember so well. And this, I love Uriah Heep, so Rough Diamond was good find because there's David Byron singing and this is something that I've been looking for for some time, so I, I bought also, also that one. Johnny Gas at San Quentin and a couple of others uh, vinyl on the same case also this isn't in best shape but it was really cheap so and if i wa find some day in better condition i can put this on the wall or something if i would have room for that budget bin steel well uh, for this one I could, uh, let's say, uh, I would, uh, I can choose something that isn't, let's go first, um, and number one, uh, number four, uh, number five, <laughs> oh, I can, it's so hard to count these big numbers. Uh, five a great thrift store find and what's the by the way what's the difference with thrift store and flea markets because i've been using on flea flea market i in finland we say kirpputori and flea yeah but this is 
Finnish punk band Goliathan Tiekista. This is more like side project and it was like just three euros and with a song you I know. And that, that, that's last song there. That's a quite heavy and long song. Yeah, I don't know. But you, maybe you can listen twice if you have enough <coughs> time. Uh, but yeah, it's a punk music, but it's side project and it's fun because it's about uh, this a, a TV show that was uh, some years ago. Uh, the lyrics uh, comes from that and it's re been recorded in three days if this is true and budget beans uh, bean uh, now i have to go up and i will go over here i will take some uh, from here uh, for number four i will choose this youtube how to this mind metal an atomic bomb because i bought this uh, from this store that was selling often this kind of limited edition well I don't know how to limit it this is but there was also quite lim some limited versions or so-called limited versions for sale because they were too expensive and then they got cheaper and uh, yeah that's the case with this also it was Sadly, I don't remember anymore how much it was, but it was quite cheap. And there's a CD and DVD, and I don't, I, I maybe I've watched DVD, but it's it's been a long time. And I have to say that I I like this, I like this album. Uh, maybe some people don't like it, but. I like it. So there was some vinyl and some CD because I love both formats. See cassettes also, uh, but differently. Uh, but still, I like also them. Uh, eight track, I don't have mini disc. For some reason, <laughs> I'd love to have. For what? Why? I have no idea. Have a nice day and we'll meet again. Bye bye.